Hello, hello. We are here in Zion uh, in June, right before the big heat wave coming next week, doing Misery Canyon, uh, doing the West Fork. It's actually my first time. I've read lots of uh, pictures or pictures, trip reports, and I've seen pictures and videos. So kind of know what we're uh, expecting, but uh, it's going to be a hot day, high up like 97. Um, and then right now it's like 8 o'clock, so we'll see how long it takes us to do it. We've got just the four of us doing it. Um, yeah, and we'll uh, let you tag along, see uh, how this adventure turns out. But it should be pretty straightforward. We're going that way through the two uh, peaks there, just a little uh, access point. So basically we just kind of follow this uh, wash. So let's try and cross. <clears throat> we'll walk down towards the wash here. <clears throat> oh yeah, the money rock. Hey, there's some water you could drink. Ooh, yeah. Too thirsty. Uh, we probably walk in the drainage at this point since we get cliffed out right here. <sighs> nice big rock right there that we could try to climb up. So I think once you reach this, you have to go right here on this ledge yep go around it yep and there's that rock we just bypassed and then back down into the drainage we'll just follow the social path right here Do we go up or do we follow the canyon? Yeah, I'd say we probably go up. Dun dun dun. Yeah. Split up and see you. How does it look towards our right there, Nathan? Because it does go towards our left here. I mean, it just kind of wraps around. All right, we're going to take the path to the right. That's a thing, just follow the follow the drainage.
Right about to get to the, yeah. the waterfall. <laughs> nice looking back down. Now we're on our little uh, water snack break. Going up this hill. So much sand. Hate sand. Alright. This is the viewpoint. They would they just turn back here, you think? Yeah. Do you want me to take a picture of myself? Sure, yeah. So that's towards looking back towards uh, <clears throat> the road. The road is right down there. You just hike through that little crack between both canyons. Hike up this giant hill. And then you're on top of this area. And then that begins our fun hike. So far the path's been pretty uh, cut and dry, not too hard to follow. That's beautiful, like, like that. Whoa. I always thought it was so cool when you see a little fish. We were near the car, I saw one kind of had a little bit of a pattern. It's like adorable. It's sad. It's not like snakes. What kind of snakes? I don't know, just little, like pugs maybe? Like crafting or something? Something like that? I mean, no. There's a lot of like side paths everywhere, or uh, social paths. You could definitely take the wrong path somewhere, but so far we're good. Oh, well, and this is where we go left. Okay. And this is the path where we go straight towards the exit. So I was wrong, but the earlier exit. Uh, this is the path right here. So okay. right here, where it meets back up. Yep. <laughs> so we go to the left right here, up this. And then the exit path converges right there. Okay. So we don't go into this drainage right here. It's the one on the other side. Okay. <laughs> other side of this. Yeah, other side of that one, according to the map here. So. Yeah, this is really dry. Bob. So we need to head down, down that canyon down there. Yeah, I think this is the West Fork. The other one is the East Fork way over there. So I think right below us is the canyon. <laughs> it's so magical. Right there. Oh, whoa. Like a big monarch.
I think this is West Fork. Coming up right here. So this is uh, West Fork of Misery Canyon, right there. There's some oh, yeah, water in there. Water. water in the desert. Our first set of narrows here in West Fork. So after entering the narrows here, you have a rappel just right there. Maybe about 20 feet down, but nothing too bad. Just make sure you guys are double checking that equipment. Like, of course, you gotta be real careful. Check your ropes. Like, yeah. Yeah, that <laughs> is. What do you think we're doing up here? Just like swinging around, being crazy? Yeah, I think sometimes people, uh, <clears throat> I don't know, just don't trust each other. But maybe those stories on the news we hear about, you know, that's what makes them think that way. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that'd be hard to... Flash flood, yeah. or higher above, or, or above it just fell down, and the water pushed it in. Yep, that's the end of the first narrows. So the first narrows had one rappel of like 20 feet. Short and sweet, yeah. <laughs> A tamarisk plant. They're a very thirsty plant. There's actually a project out there trying to get rid of all the tamarisk um, along the Colorado and Green River. Oh, yeah? So more water goes to the homes and reservoirs okay. rather than plants. And it's an invasive plant. It's not local to here. I think the Europeans brought it over. One, two, three, four. Pad and one, two, three, and there's a rabbit as well? Something's it's chasing smaller. it. Smaller. Definitely, yeah. definitely dinosaur. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so here's the second set of narrows, maybe. Got some trees to go through. Oh, yeah, it is. 
This is my street. Okay. Yeah, it's a sand. Can you catch me, Nathan? <laughs> yeah, I use a tree. Sorry, That's easy, maybe. Pull yourself all the way down. Oh. Yeah, just use the tree, Brett. Nice job. Okay. The use the tree. Yeah, you're about two feet away. Uh, yeah. Did it. All by yourself too. Without using oh, me. Not using my help. She did it. Superstar. Saw that. Your helmet. Yep, and I'll highlight that one too. <laughs> Dunk. So we're out of the second narrows. So second one didn't have any repels, but a few short, fun down climbs. And then third set of narrows begins just right there. Entering the third narrows, like 50 yards from that one to this one. Grip to not slide. Yeah. Try to get it down. Oh, and that's it right there. So not really a third set of narrows. That was just like one more spicy, uh, fun down climb. Yeah. So that was still part of the second arrows. Coming up to some more narrows here, narrow sections. This is the, the hallway between second and third and narrows. Yeah, so this is probably starting the third and narrows. And that was the hallway. Sarah called that the Pirate Cove in uh, Spry. It was like, I can't. Unreal, it was so beautiful. Yeah. And, um, um, I think I had a bruise right here now. I'm just sliding 
you s you slid pretty fast. Yeah. Yep. This is the highest I can put a hand. <laughs> oh, I am. Don't worry. We could have Brett have one hand here, yeah. and I have one hand here. I'll be right here. All right, here we go. Yeah, so you got to hang on to that edge. Yep, gotcha. Okay. I guess we could just lower you. Yep, here we go. Let go. Yeah, let's let's go. Go. <laughs> like a now. Yeah. We're just gonna do the cheer spot right. <laughs> <laughs> nice job. Okay. You wanna film uh, Michelle coming down? Yeah. We can do the same style. Yeah. It's already on still. There we go. Okay, gotcha. How did you guys get down? I fell. <laughs> Do you just fell? Well, Nathan from fell back here. Brett threw him. Two, three feet. Ah. My legs were down. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's scary. <laughs> and he can't hold on for. <laughs> yeah. Oh, there is a lot. Guys. I know, there's one up there, but. But that saved us time. That saved us a lot of time doing that. That is kind of cool. All right, that ends the fourth narrows. That's it. Now we're on to the, I guess, fifth narrows down here. Oh, is there another narrows? Oh, it just ends right there. You could probably, yeah, down for sure, down climb this. But do you have to climb right that? Over? Or we could walk right over it and walk back down. Oh yeah, there's some webbing right there too. Mm, Way back there. The who want to repel it. But I could down climb this. This that's not hard. Because you got both sides of the wall. But yeah, go on top, Nathan, see if you can uh see if we can just walk down. <clears throat> Alright, so they're going above and bypassing this little section. But I'm gonna go right there, go through the little archway, and I down climb this. Up, but... Yeah, totally fine and easy. Transition. He's almost down. He's kind of grinding. My backpack is. Yeah. I'm down. Yeah. All right, so this will be our fifth set, set of narrows. <clears throat> She's way ahead of us. Stay away, humans. Really cool. So this is the fifth set of narrows. This is the first rappel we came to. And it's a sh short little drop. You can almost jump it. But it's about a eight foot fall. So we're just doing a double strand here. Nice and easy. Yeah, Nathan's when the hand laid it down. See how much quicker that was too. Michelle, if you want to do that. 
I can even touch your feet. It's looking back up and continuing on. <laughs> So here's the end of the fifth narrows. And the fifth narrows had the second rappel of like eight feet. So here we go. Back to the open wash. I was gonna jump, but I did. Yeah. It's not bad if you, get me. If you bend your knees. I can't. Uh, I'll catch you like right. Yeah, it's gonna slide down. I'll let you slide until your bum's like right here, okay? <laughs> Very graceful. <laughs> Good job. But the one Brett Ward me. So I think right up here where we hit the other cliff side right there. That's where the East Fork joins in because we're in the West Fork of Misery. So I think the East Fork is just right ahead of us. And then from there, we just got that last section of Narrows. Then we hit the river. Right. So probably not too much farther. Yeah, hang on the left side there. Yeah, so I think the rappel is from that rock bollard anchor. Rappel down that. The next one's just right there. Okay. This is it. All right, so this is our third rappel um, in the west fork. And that's the east fork joining up right down there. You might be able to bypass up on top. If you walk on top of the rocks, you might be able to walk down over there. But we'll stay in the water course. Water course. <clears throat> Tad's is kind of scary, man. Just due to the awkward rappel. You have to yeah. flip around. Okay. There you go. You got it. You made it. Looking back up the rappel, on to the next one. We can have a lowering down this one. That's not that far, huh? <clears throat> uh, repel. If I say just capture, he'll be faster. Need my uh, shoulder there? I think I'll just jump to the sand. We can step my shoulder if you want. Uh, I'll have to jump over here. Other shoulder. This. Good job. But now we can help you, help you guys out. Like yeah. Like turn around. Okay, hold on, hold on. There we go. Nice. Hey, that's a good technique. <laughs> good job. That was nice, actually. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that saves some time. Oh, yeah. Doing that versus repelling. Yeah. 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 It's a giant pothole, huh? Yeah. 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 
That's a big pothole. If you can uh, hold me up here. Hold yourself. Yeah, just a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> hold everyone. Yeah. Thanks, guys. Here we go down the slide. I think the best way to do the last part is just have fun. Yeah, <laughs> have fun. The Good. Best way to do that. And then slowly slide down towards me where my foot is. Oh, oh, don't go too far. You went past it. <laughs> you went past the, my foot. Sorry. <laughs> That's fine. Sorry, That's fine. Maybe Sarah should do this. Oh you can keep on going. <laughs> Just walk down. Kind of fun little <clears throat> uh, shoot there. Yeah. So we got another one. Right there, I can see the webbing right there. You'd have to run that way. You probably could step down right there. And just kind of well, skip. The thing that scares me is if you missed that ledge, then you would just slide just right slide. down. Ooh. Yeah, you slide down. And crumple. But there is a propelling here right there, though. Yeah. yeah. Are you good? Just yeah. hand line down the entire thing. We are now <clears throat> joining the west and east fork of Misery. Now we go straight down canyon. And I think the other side of that, or the other side, uh, in front of this cliff side is where the river is. So it's getting hot though, huh? What time is it? 1.50. So it took us uh, five hours so far from the trailhead to the end of the West Fork to the confluence. Five hours, that includes uh, lunch breaks and picture taking, playing around and repels and stuff. Ooh, we're coming up to the, the next Narrows. All right. So, there might be a repel. <laughs> Yeah, bigger rappel. So we'll have to clip in up here. Sit down. Nice job. And catch. I swear I would drop. <laughs> Perfect. Slide down. So here we are in this pothole. 
Yeah, it's going down right here. Yeah, let's look at that, see? Use my feet, slide down here. Use your hands themselves. Yeah, that's pretty easy. I like that. Okay, I'm gonna grab your left right foot. Oh, perfect. Thanks. Thanks. Good job. It's kind of a cool little uh, pour off. Pirate Cove. Yep. Some deep narrows up there. Must be water down there. Amazing. Oh, there is water. Hey, little froggy. <clears throat> I'm lost, you guys. I'm going to be straight. Nope. Can you spider man it? No, it's. No, that would be spider man of the century. Yeah. Too bad, actually. Yeah, a little refreshing. You okay, Brett? Yeah, I'm waiting for you guys. I think I smell sulfur. Oh, you know what that means? A fart. The sulfur spring. So I wonder if we hit a spring level. That's why these are so clean looking. Yeah. So this is a uh, fresh, clean water. Yeah. Yeah, this might be uh, just all spring fed. I think it feels pretty nice. It smells nice. Fresh, clean water. We're going into the abyss. There's a little wedge. Here you go.
Oh, I'll get it. I'll get a video of it for sure. Yeah, this has to be spring fed. Just given how clean it is. Based on the other pools of water. Yep. Actually, it doesn't feel too bad. Like, it's kind of refreshing, you know? Like, yeah, way too bad. Probably like 97 degrees outside. Do you see the show there? Oh, yeah. Look how dark it is down there. Yeah, it's like heat. Look at that uh, arch right there. That's a cool looking arch. Wow. Looks like. <laughs> oh, chesty. Oh. Yeah. That's beautiful. It's kind of dark. Yeah. <clears throat> this is super cool. Yeah. I think so too. Oh, sure. Thank you, Michelle. I don't even, actually, I don't mind it because the water's not that gross. Yeah. Wow, that's beautiful. That's an old one though. Yeah, I don't think we use that one. I think we just follow this down. Yeah, I don't know why it's Yeah, this, this is it. Does that qualify as a waterfall? Yeah, there's a little hand, <laughs> there's a little hand line right here. Oh yeah, perfect. This might be a little bit slippery. I can't tell how deep it is. Warm. That's good news. Yeah, that's about bathtub warm right there. Feels nice. Oh yeah. Now people just slide down this from what I heard from what I have heard. Backpack top one. And can you zip it up? This is crazy. I've never seen anything like this. I'm glad we did this one. Yeah. Is that swimming depth? Okay. You're gonna slide down? Yeah, you got it. Yeah, slide into it. Just <laughs> 
a helicopter just flew right above us. That was like 500 feet above us. <laughs> no. Didn't even touch you. The water just built up behind me. Flushed you down? Yeah. Very yeah. nice. <laughs> oh, that's warm. And smelly. <laughs> Thank you. Another one. Yeah. What'd you guys think of uh, Misery Canyon? That's basically it, huh? Amazing. That's yeah, amazing. my favorite. Right? So far. So Still far. a lot more out there. You get a swim. Beautiful. Hot, cold, hot. Hot, cold, yeah. Yeah. Uh, warm spring. Fern garden. Fresh water at the very end. Super long. Walking through the creek. And then, yeah, three hours of hiking out. So now we have to look for a spring to filter our water. We came from right there. Parunuip coming down. We're going downstream. <laughs> nice. <clears throat> Why is this crazy? So <clears throat> but water's clear. However, all this water comes uh, downrange from all the farms and agriculture and cows and stuff. So, so could be nasty. Uh, I probably wouldn't filter here unless I had no other choice. I would find a spring to filter my water from. <laughs> gotta go. You gotta go all the way through. All the way through. Oh, it's waist deep. Yeah, Michelle, do it. It's waist deep. Keep your legs out. Watch out, Rob.
So here's the exit. Just going up that weakness. Uh, and there, there's a bunch of seeps that we pass for water, but they're like kind of slow. Um, but right across from the exit, there's this little side canyon and you can see some water trickling through. So we're gonna filter that just cause down range of this, uh, well, up range from the creek is where all the farmlands and cows are. And filters want, wouldn't really purify that. So we're gonna do this little uh, spring kind of creek here, uh, as that might be our best tasting uh, and s safe water. A little uh, small creek right here. The water's pretty cool, actually. <clears throat> so it'll feel nice to drink. All right, just got done filtering. Now it's back to uh, the exit right there. Okay. All right, let's go. So is the sunscreen up in the top here? It is, yeah. Do it. Oh, the birds are out. Okay. Heading back towards the exit. Four fifteen. We're beginning the misery exit right now. We refilled all our waters. They soaked in the rivers, and here we go. It even tastes better than St. George water. Yeah, probably. Just follow the course here, I think, for the trail. We need to go left, Nathan. Congratulations for getting rich. <laughs> so we have to go. Uh... We have to go left here. Yeah, I think we go left to the top. Yeah, I'd say keep working your way that way. Like follow kind of, yeah, follow the pathway over there. The other footprints, yeah. See the cairn. We are back on the path. That was a wild uh, half mile or so uh, detour there. But now we're back on the path. Yeah, so we went to the right side of it rather than staying to the left side of it. Uh, that was steep.
yeah, I think we just keep going on this path until we hit the meetup. Now this was our divergent path. There it is. All right, I'm on my last GoPro battery, number eight. Whoa. We're yeah. we're just going up the last hill, and then down the canyon to our car. Whew. On top of the hill. Yep. Road's just right there, Nathan. Uh, where the sun is sitting? There's a line. You can see it. Yep, cars are not too far away from here. Nice little footpath on the sand going down. Yep, I can see the parked car on the map now. We're almost there. Maybe half a mile or less. And plus having the finish line in sight is awesome too. Yeah, your body's like, go, go. Yep. Ugh. Like doing a squat right now. Like 
sometimes just like either look up at the stars or look yeah. at the giant cliff and be like, wow. And just like, oh, that sounds kind of hard. But the same time, it's like, oh, that's just kind of amazing. Like, we are just like, So the entire day, we didn't see anyone else except for those three people uh, in the morning that we passed. <clears throat> 12 hours. Yeah. Yep. <clears throat> so 12 hours, almost exactly. But that also includes uh, break time oh. and lunch time and purifying time. Now, last question. What did you think of the exit? Uh, <laughs> it was kind of hard. Yeah. It was just long. Hours in the blistering heat. Hours in the blistering heat. Yep. Uh, yep. Got to be careful these cars flying past us. So 11 hours, 30 minutes. You guys like that? Sarah was dying laughing. You guys have it kind of too. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. My toes are like they're gonna fall. Oh yeah.